Acmethred. Acmethred is the modified form of square thread and has a thread angle of 29 degree. Square thread in the modified form is Acmethred. Acmethred in the thread angle is degree. The thread depth is half of the pitch. Acmethred in the depth pitch in the pagadi arikim. The crust and the root are flat. This is the crust and root. This shape is easier to fabricate than a square thread. One square thread is cut in a square thread. We have to acme thread to fabricate. The thread profile shape has a wider base so that the thread is stronger than square thread and is ideal for power transmission. Acme thread in the base is very weak. That's why the square thread in the base is very weak. That's why the square thread in the base is very weak. They are widely used in lead screw of lathe. One lathe machine in the lead screw I to be like another acme thread done. Let us draw an acme thread having a pitch of 50 millimeter. Amba the millimeter pitch or la or the acme thread the number of work. As we discussed earlier, the thread angle of acme thread is 29 degree. Acme thread in the thread angle is 29 degree. Height of the acme thread is the sum of 0.25 mm and half of the pitch. Pitch in the pagadida gude, 0.25 mm gude adige in the acme thread in the height. The width of crust and root E is equal to 0.3707 multiplied with the pitch of the thread. Thread in the pitch in a 0.3707 एन्न वैल्यू कोंड मल्टिप्लाई चेद किट्टन आंसर आण नम्मड क्रस्ट इंडेईम रूट इंडेईम विट्ट First of all draw a line with a distance equal to double the value of pitch pitch इंडे इरट्टी distance वरतक रीदील उरु line वरिग्या Mark the distance of pitch and the crust from the left end of the line Pitch distance aya 50 millimeter. Crust in the width distance aya 18.535 millimeter. Line in the left side in the mark jiga. Offset the line to the bottom side with a distance equal to height of the thread. Here it is 25.25 millimeter. E line in the agmi thread in the height aya 25.25 millimeter ta aya ke. Now we need to draw the flank of the thread. One thread is having two flanks and the thread angle is 29 degree. So that the angle of one flank from the vertical line will be half of that angle. That is equal to 14.5 degree. One acme thread in the two flank angle is 29 degree. That is the thread angle is 29 degree. That is the angle of one flank in the thread. Vertical line might be in the angle in the 14.5 degree. Mark the flank angle of 14.5 degree with the help of a protractor and draw the flank. Crust in the end of the number of the construction line is in the 14.5 degree. The angle is in the 14.5 degree. This is the angle of the flank in the flank. The root is also having the same distance as the crust. Mark the root distance to the right side of the flank end. Acme thread is crust in the root in the distance same. This distance is flank in the end of the flank end. Join this root end with the crust end of the next thread. We will mark the root end end and the thread end of the crust end end of the flank. Continue the same procedure for drawing the remaining threads. This is the same thread. Highlight the edges of the thread using darker pen. This is the dark color of the thread. Highlight the thread. 
provide the dimensions of thread that is thread height and thread angle thread height um thread in the angle um mark cheyuka hatch the thread portion to complete the drawing thread in the bhagam hatch cheyidu konde drawing complete cheyuka you may also draw the acme thread using the same procedure thank you for watching the video